guys welcome to my youtube channel i am promise of ejiro ujakarutu your favorite storyteller and screenwriter so on today's video i'll be telling you guys how i started writing so i've been getting a lot of questions about how i started writing <laughs> i started writing stories with pegs <laughs> yes you heard correctly pegs or clothes clip whatever you know it as growing up we used to have a lot of these at home a lot of pegs i'd gather my cousins siblings and friends while i was very young i think age seven if i can remember yeah and i'll start telling them stories narrating with pegs bigger ones were the parents and the smaller one the the younger ones so i'll demonstrate to the pegs and they will all be glued like i'll capture their attention totally i'll be telling stories let's say this is a woman and this is her daughter like why did you do that i warned you severally do not go there you didn't listen and you, and the daughter will be like no mommy i'm so sorry i didn't mean to disobey you that's how i started and they will all be glued and then i'll use our wardrobe as they are asked. so my siblings cousins and friends back then they enjoyed my storytelling so much that i can get them to do my shows <laughs> get them to wash the dishes clean and do us to run errands for me just the promise of telling them a story yeah i actually use the privilege There were a lot of times I got beaten for misplacing the pegs. <laughs> yes, I used them a lot to the point that some of them got missing. But it was actually an interesting experience. I'm, from my secondary school, I started writing short stories and um, I was getting into trouble because my pen was always getting exhausted. When I'm done writing, um, I'll give it to my friends in school and they'll read and they'll tell me they want a part two, they want more and that's how I started writing stories but when I started writing stories in secondary school my parents would always complain because I was always demanding for new pens and they are like how come you misplace your pens and I'll provide them with the empty ink pipe I did not misplace the pens and they'll be like you actually emptied the pipe like the ink is finished what are you writing? <laughs> I was writing stories I'm very passionate about storytelling I'm very passionate about screenwriting and after secondary school I had a phone and I started writing on Facebook I had a lot of audience on Facebook I was posting short series short story series and I had a lot of people reading my stories asking for more and all <laughs> i'm going to make more videos telling you guys everything you need to know about me as a writer my experiences in the industry so far and i'm going to tell you more stories about my favorite stories which happen to be your favorite stories as well <laughs> so guys here is a trailer for the art fragrance one of my favorite stories why do I need to get a job when you earn so much? Can you even come into somebody's life and then just disappear like that and you're, you're, you're blocking the person? I don't want to date you. That guy has a fiance. I'm just concerned about customer satisfaction. Customer satisfaction will kill you then. Are you falling for this girl? <laughs> Look at I mean, you're just flush because of him. You're on Instagram all day. Yet you barely have 1,500 followers on your team. You can shut your dog down your ass! Why did you have to text my friend with an anonymous identity? Oh, this is my wedding. It has to be a giant house. I need to train on my wedding day. You and Chris use that dog back. Hey, Chris, can you see yourself? I'm in love with a stranger. Ah. I had to, to get my food. I'm in love with you owe me no explanation. Please take me. So presently, I've written over 70 screenplays and over 40 of them are already streaming. Some of them are streaming on this platform. Some are airing on African Magic Showcase, African Magic Urban, in all African Magic channels and Rock TV. So <laughs> see how far we've come. <laughs> so guys, Just Like Rainbows is also one of my favorite stories. Here's the trailer. Where's my son? Mommy! 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 I 
Hi. Hi, Scarlett Okoye. You are the most insensitive person I've ever met. Come on, Scarlett. Yes, Jesus. Just the truth. Hey, 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 wait, 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 you want us to take him out of life support, so better. Go to where will he ever wake up? This guy has been lying down there for the past few months. So many other beautiful stories like it's us to forever baby quest by my window on page that's one on true colors and so so many other movies i cannot really start listing you can check them out on chain about tv or just search out the titles on youtube i have the list of my films on my bio here on youtube in our next video, I'm going to be telling you guys how I actually got into the industry, the screenwriting industry. <laughs> it's a very interesting story, funny actually. I can't wait for you guys to hear it. If you like this video and you want more of this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, turn on the post notification, and leave a comment.